letdown reflex. What is it? It is a release of milk by a hormone called oxytocin. Oxytocin is a love hormone associated with feelings of calm and connection. Triggering a letdown is vital to milk production and to get the milk flowing. Without it, you may only collect a few drops of milk. When feeding or expressing, nerves in the nipple send a message to the brain to release oxytocin. The oxytocin release causes a small muscle cells surrounding the milk producing cells to squeeze and contract. Milk is then pushed through the milk ducts and injected from the nipple. Some people feel tingling, pressure or pins and needles during a letdown. Other people feel nothing. Both are completely normal. You may have several letdowns during a feed or expressing session. The letdown may bring feelings of calm, sleepiness and increased thirst for the parent. For the first few days postpartum, you may experience cramps while feeding or expressing. This is caused by oxytocin contracting your uterus back to its pre-pregnancy size. If you are stressed or anxious about expressing, the oxytocin response can be temporarily inhibited. Relaxation is key in order to release oxytocin and trigger a letdown. We need to prepare our body and our mind. So how can we increase oxytocin? Create your oxytocin-filled environment. Get comfortable. Before expressing, try some gentle breast massage or a warm compress. Touching your baby, if you are together, or the smell of your baby, or a picture of them can help as well. Using mindfulness tools, such as breathing techniques and listening to guided relaxations. Or you could try watching your favourite TV show. It is really individual to you. Over time, the letdown reflex becomes conditioned. It may even be triggered by the sound or sight of your breast pump. If you want to learn more, click the link below.